Let's get going. Banjo Katui. Uh, connect Xbox Live. Yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. Let me guess. Not gonna let me sign in for some insane reason. Xbox needs to be updated a million times over. Domain title still Kabanjo Kazooie. Oh, yeah, right, yeah. I thought I changed everything there, but I did not change Tui. I always think this is called Banjo Kazooie 2 for some reason in my head, but it's not as Banjo Tui. Alright. So this kicks off. I don't know how long it kicks off after the first one. Oh, God, look, there's even a. They just can't make us forget about freaking nuts and bolts. There's even a copy of it on the table. Must you? Must you game? There we go. Right, so this kicks off. I can't remember how long passed. It must have been a while because Bruntilda is just a pile of bones. Two years we go. Two years have passed since Gruntilda the Witch was defeated by Banjo and Kazooie. After fo falling from her tower, she was buried underground, where she remains until this very day. St still trying to get her loose? That's what he said. He said, No good. Mistress still can't shift rock. Has he been trying to push that for two years? All because of that stupid bear. Stupid. Yeah, this is the most use my Xbox has got in a while. Mumbo, play well, has much of bear's cash. He's right, Kazooie. <laughs> there goes your bird seed money. Don't be so sure, Banjo. Hey, look outside, everyone. Grunty the witch is back. Is coming, uh, is coming, sorry. Oh. Where, where, Kazooie? I can't see her. Oh, uh, false alarm bottles, you know. Uh, must have been some shadows. Ah, uh, come on, Boneface, let's, uh, let's play. I feel lucky. there originally, so I don't know how that appeared. Uh-oh, it's a giant rotating dildo. It's a drill. S stop rocking the table! You're making me sick! Momomo, not r r rocking the table. Whole house shakes like... Perhaps one of us should go to take a look outside. Improve the lighting since the original, I think. Look at that thing. Look at that thing penetrating through the rock. God, that is an insanely long drill. That is bonkers. Considering the size of the rest of it, that drill is outrageously long. Hey, Wogan Taco. Hello, hurry, Blue <laughs> Blub Elder. Our sister is waiting. Uh, 
Yeah, quickly, we must go, or angry Grunty will be. Then get off me, you must, or move, I cannot. Oh, she talks like Yoda. Move, I cannot. It stopped. Now I wonder what it was. Sure was noisy. Let's go take a look, Kazooie. But it's dark out there, and uh, I'll be scared. Yeah, two years to get here. Mumble, much brave. Me go look outside. Back in minute. Bam, bam. What a sucker, huh? Come on, Banjo. Give me a hand. Kazooie! Bam, bam. I notice how Banjo's not doing anything to stop her. He's just saying Kazooie. Sorry, mistress. I failed you. Oh, why, Grunty? Grunty mustn't get you out. Your sisters will. Big Rock is so powers we must combine. Grunty sisters, you should not mock. Now watch our magic blast this rock. <laughs> that's the mag That's the magic spell for Boulder Blaster. BK Brew. <laughs> I mean, that's more lifting, but all right. God, Rock has, so out you can come. And you can go. And now she's a skeleton. Turns out, she wasn't big, she was just big bone this whole time. No, 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 this cannot be. What's happened to little old me? Nice grunty looks. Lost weight you have. I hate bones, a body I need. Can you help me? Can you help with this little deed? There I fell out. Yes, plan to help we have. So back to our castle. We must go. Right then, right then, girls, let's fix me up. Then Banjo's hairy butt, I'll whoop. Yeah, I know, what a specific spell. I think rips out of her dress. I don't know. This is not good, me go tell Banjo. Ah, seen as Bony Man has, him he we must whack. Leave, the, leave it to me, he's no hassle. I'll kick butt, then off to the castle. I knew she was going to say that. Yeah, there's a lot of jiggle physics going on on these two. Guess I'll, guess I'll be having that bird seat after all, huh, Banjo? But you cheated, Kazooie. That's not... Uh, everyone, gas, must run. Pan, uh, quick, Grunty coming. He says, I said pan like I'm supposed to read it then. Revenge is mine, I cannot miss. Let's see that fairy fool dodge this. Yeah, yeah, skull boy. I bet she had two heads. No, joke. Look. <laughs> Spell coming. He's right. Quickly, everyone, out. Leave the money. I'm not falling for that trick again. I'm staying right here. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> Balls is dead in it. Hurry, you must. Ready to leave, we are. Hold on, sis. I'm nearly there. I've just been to blast that bear. <laughs> that bear. There you go. Oops, we will leave. Wow, how many, how big is this place? <laughs> A couple of pterodactyls and some green goopy monsters. Just a moment. I'm nearly there, sis. I'm nearly there. Just one moment longer. Stop. Wait for me, Mistress Grunty. No, 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 Klungo. You stay here. I'll be back. 
Have no fear. Oh, he spent two years trying to get you out of a rock. Come on, repay the man. Wow, talk about talk about gratitude. You spent two years trying to get her out of there. Wow, our house is ruined. Grow, grow, mumbles head out. Look at our house. Well, at least everyone got out safely. Hang on, where's Goggle Boy? Looks much unwell. It's worse than that. Grundy's killed poor bottles. And he's a ghost. He wasn't that. He wasn't the favorite character in Banjo Kazooie anyway. Wow. Sorry. <laughs> Grunty wreck house and kill bottles. She must pay. Bear and bird get after witch. Mumbo, see you later. Oh great, I get to pick some more witch bud. Let's go, Banjo. <sighs> I have a feeling it's not going to be so easy this time. Damn. Straight up this game is getting this game's so dark, bro. We're in that uh, we're in that two thousands edge now. Everything's edgy. I love how it's like the sad version of the Sparrow Mountain theme. Get that music up bang. Music's like the best bit. Look, I can still see my old dirt piles. Press B to interact with them to rem remind you of your original moves. Help, it's me, Roystein. I was knocked off the barbecue and ended up under this rather weighty boulder. Please get rid of it. I can hardly breathe. Oh, I think I need the drill power for that, don't I? Ho 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 ho! Stupid Baron Bird! Coming! Me wait for them in here! Is, is, I can't remember if Bottles stays dead or not. I like that you keep all your moves from the original, uh, from the original game in this. They just, rather than like take away moves and teach them again, you learn new moves basically. The rolling in this is way better as well. <laughs> <coughs> Metroid. <laughs> I'll forgive Metroid because I love it so much. But yes, Metroid does come to mind. My man, it's not even that deep. <laughs> Jesus, gosh, she must be bored as hell for two years. Man, this place is a. Um, how did that? How did that one explosion on the house make this place such a mess? It's like. Did Banjo and Kazooie just like destroy this in the two years since? Oh, 
Oh my god, why the hell is the flying inverted? What is this? So this is the entrance to Grunty's lair from uh, from before, but now it's all just wrecked. You can't go anywhere. It's just Cheeto hanging out. Hello again, Banjo. Remember me? I'm Cheeto, the magical book. Yeah, yeah, we know who you are. Just hand over something useful. You're out of luck there, I'm afraid. Grunty ripped out all my pages because I helped you in the last game. I'd be most grateful if you could look out for them on your travels. Maybe. What's in it for us? Well, for every five pages you return, I'll let you in on a little secret. Well, you mean to cheat? Well, I'm not called Cheeto for nothing. Well done, you found one of my missing pages. Collect five, then return them to me in Grunty's old lair in Spiral Mountain. Thanks, book. My old tutorial haunt. It's all destroyed now. I'm so sad. Let's check if uh, is there a one up in the one up space again? There's a there is a Kazooie rock down there. Okay. I need a I need Kazooie to a pretty I I remember there being Kazooie uh, power. There's like you could separate Kazooie and Banjo in this. Fly. It looks like there's. It looks like there might be something else to do here where I can fly. I saw a grate. I'm pretty sure I can break the grate. I 
can't remember what's inside of here. Behind the waterfall. It's a banjo kazooie cartridge. Don't remember what that's for. <laughs> Don't remember what that's for. I will remember eventually, I'm sure. Oh, there's no oh man, nothing in there. <laughs> Why is it in jail? Crimes at the Banjo Kazooie game too. <laughs> war crimes, actually. Really serious war crimes. Unspeakable. They're so bad I can't even speak of them or remember them. <clears throat> mm, I don't recall anything like that happening. Uh, you were stupid. Uh, at least we can speak properly. Uh, 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 Clunker was mad now. Your game ends here. It's time for the first boss boss. Yeah, that's what I like about Banjo Kazooie is that you can do all of it in one go. And he is huge. Clever Magic Shield, now show Bear my special potion. Yeah, I did see Batman, yeah, that these uh, annoying hints are actually. Optional, which is fantastic. Oh, ow. Do you know what I've just realized? That sound is the Donkey Kong sound. That's the sound Donkey Kong makes. The, uh, that's the Donkey Kong 64 Donkey Kong sound. Nasty bear and bird hurts poor Klongo. You asked for it. Why don't you run off and we'll forget this ever happened? You're yeah, a good idea, but you're not seeing the last of Klongo. Donkey Kong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is actually after Donkey Kong 64. The fit Banjo Kazooie is before Donkey Kong 64. Banjo Kazooie is after, because Donkey Kong 64 was the year between the two. Didn't enjoy Donkey Kong 64 at all. It's definitely, uh, it definitely, uh, can be a bit love hatey depending on if you're, like, down for the insane amount of collecting in it. It takes collective onto a whole new level. Man, that poor house! Mm -hmm. the remastered on 64. That'd be interesting. In love and memory! In love and memory of the Grey Ginger family! Passed away unexpectedly when a huge digging machine flattened their house! Right, so this is Jinjo Village, where we... Where the Jinjos live, and when you when you 
get the gingos, then they come back, come back here, basically. And then you slowly fill up Jinjo Town, and then you see King Jinjo. This is my palace, not bad, eh? Just come on in and see me. Man, look at that. All these, all these Jinjos live like ten people. They live like ten, ten families in one of these houses. And freaking King Jinjo lives in this mansion. This is one of my silos. Open up some more to create a network of shortcut tunnels. Ten hook. Yeah, he's wiping everyone in this. Oh no, the back of the house has been knocked off. Oh, fuck, I forgot about Ball's house. King Jingling. Oh, Jingling, that's his name. And that's the thing from Banjo Kazooie that the other guy had. Yo, what's up? I'm King Jingling, king of all things Jinjo and ruler of this village. <laughs> Your kingdom seems a bit empty. My people were scattered away by those witches and their giant machine. I kind of like it quiet. But I need to get them all back for the kickball tournament next week. Doesn't seem that important to me. Oh, but it is. There's a big kickball rivalry between the Jinjos and the Moles, which means there could be trouble if we don't turn up. Oh, dear. Exactly. Anyway, here's an incentive for you to rescue my people. I believe you should... Go and see Master Jiggy Wiggy in his temple. Jiggy who? Uh, Jiggy Wiggy. He's the leader of a secret and ancient order dedicated to the mystical powers of the Crystal Jiggy. Ancient or oh, Crystal Jiggy? You just made that up, didn't you? No, honest. It's all true. I'm super serial. He's very important to your adventure. And I'm super serial. And it's only the Crystal Jiggy can open the worlds that you must enter. And I'm very serial. <laughs> It'll be my pleasure. This way. I can't even be like, why did that door just open? Not bad for a king, huh? Yeah, his strange pet thingy was cool. Let's go and find that Jimmy Wiggy then. <laughs> Jimmy Wiggy. I'm super serial. I'm King Jingling and I'm very serial right now. I'm super serial. No one believes me. The Jiggy Wiggy is real. Sisters, tie my lock. What's the plan to get my body back? Annoying your rhyming is, so stop it or we will not help. Oh yeah, they just stopped the rhyming now. Oh. If I must. And then she doesn't rhyme for the rest of the game, I don't think. B.O.B. This is. Big ol' blaster built by Mingy and me. Life force from ground plants and creatures that can suck. Went from suck to blow. Stored in big tank life forces. Shower Gwenty will take when tank is full. When new body you will have. An evil heartless plan. I like it. How long will it take to suck up enough life force? Yeah, I think they were just sick of making a rhyme. So they were like, oh, fuck it, whatever. Not slim you are, so plenty will be needed. <laughs> Oh, so start blasting! Impatient you must be! Target you first must pick! Hmm, that cursed jingling has just given the fairy fool a jiggy! I reckon we should blast the Jinjo King! Auto targeting BOB has. has sorry, as button you only have to press! Quick suck!
She runs up smoke. I think she actually might rhyme at the very end of the game. She says to me, like, screw it, I'm going back to rhyming, I think, at the very end. Perhaps. Like, maybe when her sisters get... I think it's when, it's when you beat her sisters or something, I swear she goes back to rhyming. Target B.O.B. has hit. Steal life force, he will. I should do Yoda for him. On Loki B.O.B. Waltz, Bear was just missed. Never mind him. What about that traitor? Jingling. Just a zombie now. Oh no, it is pet is just a pair of eyeballs. Six. <clears throat> mm, successful BOB was. Jingling's life force, you must have. Mm, yes, yes, Jingling's life force. There you go, that's kinda it. Right then, girls, let's get this owl island sucking. This we can do, but big charge up the OB will need. Hours it will take, and revenge bear will seek. Ah, uh, you know what? Whatever, it'll be whatever voice it is. Uh, I wouldn't worry. Banjo's got no one to help him now that Mole and Jingling are gone. He'll never get to us in time. <laughs> Love the music goes. Grass! Slow. Tastes bad! It's been a wonderful two years' time. Never again will you hear me rhyme. Oh no. Can I hear you rhyme at four years if you're still around that long? <laughs> can I have my. Can I, or maybe a yearly rhyme? No, hit my little, little weird pet. Ow. Old King Cole. Oh yeah, he's a right one. Well, the couch's the couch's king has eyes because the pet that the, was that was there has been turned to ash. So I guess, I guess maybe it's been also kind of just morphed into the sofa. Oh, thank you, Lama. I feel so honored. <laughs> oh man, I tell you what. Do you remember, you remember all that time? you remember years ago on stream when I made a, I told Alexa to remind me when, um, uh, the, I made it, like, I said that Cube World will be out at, at like, in, like, remind me in, like, two years or something like that, or a year. And then, one day while I was sitting in the living room, Alexa suddenly started saying, "Your reminder, <laughs> the Cube World is gonna be out." It like literally like a year and a half later, suddenly she said that, and it was like just a couple days after Cube World had come out, and I'd actually almost got it right. And I was just like, "Oh my god, I'd forgotten I'd even made that." It was fucking bizarre. I didn't think she would even like keep that for that long. Oh there, Banjo. How are we today? Oh, pr pretty good, Mrs. Bottles. And yourself? Oh, fine, fine. Uh, tell her about Ghosty Boy. Keep quiet, Kazooie. What was that? Is Bottles okay? He should be back from Spiral Mountain for his dinner soon. He never misses his dinner, you know. Er, uh, I'm sure he'll be back soon, uh, Mrs. B. <laughs> we'll just not tell her that her husband got blown up, I guess. Uh, there's a monster in your bedroom? <laughs> no, that was our little- that was our pet gimp! No! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Uh, you, you, you escaped from the closet. Oh, shit. Oh, 
There we go. Is that Bottles' his normal wife? That is Bottles' his wife. He also has kids as well, <laughs> which you don't even know about until this part. <laughs> There's a uh, picture of Jet Force Gemini. Hello, Banjo. Hi, Goggles. Well, since you and Daddy are such good friends, I'll give you these prototype glasses he's working on. Did he finish working on them by any chance? Oh, yes. I believe they're called the Amazo Gaze Glasses. Well, how do they work? Well, when in Banjo's eyes, view, uh, use right stick up and down to zoom in and out. Not bad. There we go. There we go. Again, the ability to zoom in and out. Really loving that and making nods there of the games. I think that's the other Jet Force Gemini character, I believe. Yep. Very short, very, very short skirt. <laughs> Jesus. Hey there, Banjo! Hi, it's Becky. Me and Daddy are going to be playing in the kickball tournament next week over at the Mayan Stadium. King Jingling is organized especially for my dad since he's such a hero. Uh, I don't suppose you have any substitutes. Why would we need substitutes? My dad is the best on the team. Uh, I'm sure he was. Uh, uh, is. And did you know the tunnel over there is my secret way out of the village? You might find it useful. Uh, we already know that. King Dingle, Dangle Dangle Dang is a personal friend of ours. He opened it up especially for us. Oh, nice. <laughs> I love that, because he was like, uh, you don't have any substitutes, do you? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Tiggy Wiggy, and this is my temple. If you want to see me, you'll need to get past my dormant first. God, they're introducing so many characters. Right, let's let's let's, let's hatch all of the eggs real fast from the from the swap and stop and swap in the first game. Clock, hello, clock, clock, clock. Okay, she's gonna repeat herself a lot here, so we're just gonna have to fly for this if we can. Apologize, because it's gonna have this gonna do this six times now. Pet man, what is this? Pizza, pasta, put it in the box. What'd you all get up to today then? We'll have some we'll have some mad bands while the chicken lays six eggs. Jazz might be doing a sp special stream tomorrow morning. Gonna, Jazz wants to clear out the uh, the cupboard, don't you? So we're thinking we might um, we might stream ourselves cleaning out the cupboard full of crap, basically, <laughs> for the morning. And then I gotta drop off Jazz somewhere, and then after that, when I go get her again, uh, then we'll carry the stream on after that. 
So I might start a bit early, and then me and Jazz are gonna empty out this cupboard that's just full of crap. It's like basically, you know, you know when you, you know that place in your house you have where you put things you don't know where they really belong. Uh, so you just kind of, you just kind of like shove it in the cupboard. That's we have that cupboard, you know, the the cupboard of random crap, basically. Like I don't know where to put this, so I guess I'll just stick it in this cupboard. And then over time, that cupboard becomes unruly and out of control, and you're just like, oh god. At the moment, that cupboard is full of old old wires of mine, um, Christmas decorations. Um, Towels, folders from Jazz's, I think, from Universe? From Uni, I think. Yeah. And, like, other stuff. More things keep ending up. The wheel for the truck streams is in there. I like the way she hatched. Look, when she's trying to hatch the eggs, it looks like she's, tr she's trying to shove them up her bum again. Get him there. Six eggs, I think. I think there's like one more egg after this. I don't know if that was five or more. I got all the eggs from the stop and swap from the first game, so I might as well hatch them all now. Eggy hatching. Who'd have thought stop and swap would come to this? I'll be marching next. Cook and it over. Was there a Euro Truck Sim this past Valentine's Day? Yeah, there was. It was uh, me and Jazz did one. Unfortunately, it's not... Wait, no, it is saved. Yes, it is on YouTube, actually. <laughs> Who is Ginger? Right, is there any more to do? Last egg. Tired now. How do you think I feel carrying them for ten years? I wait, waiting. <laughs> did this get? Did this? Did they get? Did they remaster this in 2010? I think they might have actually. Who's Jinjo? I think what they're making a nod to is the fact that because they ne the stop and swap thing was cancelled from the original Banjo, and since they implemented it in this version... I guess it would have been about 10 years since it got cancelled, basically, so I think that's what they're making a reference to. 20 of birthdays. <laughs> you think so? Surely Rare will make the next game faster than that. Top stop and swap 2 found. Special legs are all hatched. <laughs> yeah, we don't talk about nuts and bolts. Shitting nuts. I am lowly disciple of Jiggy Wiggy. I work the door of his sacred temple to keep out those who are not worthy. Ah, wow, sounds like fun. Do you think we are worthy? Uh, it depends. To prove yourself worthy to enter, you must collect images in the form of Jiggy Wiggy himself. And what the, might these images look like? Uh, jigsaw pieces, also known as Jiggies. That sounds familiar. I mean, wrong voice. That sounds familiar. Let's see what you have then. It seems you have enough collected enough jiggies to be allowed inside. Remember, no cameras permitted, and only only food purchased at McJiggies can be eaten within. <coughs> Bit then, McJiggies. Greetings, O oh chosen one. You have entered the sacred temple of Jiggy Wiggy. Approach the golden monolith. If you wish to prove yourself worthy. 
Look at that. Look at those beautiful reflections. Press B when near the monolith to attempt Jiggy Wiggy's challenge. One. When Fortune smiles here will be written the Jiggy Secrets. They, up, they upgraded the uh, fill in the things that open new worlds to like the, the bottles puzzle thing, basically. Pilot and Grunty's Revenge, I think it's called, the GBA ones. Mm. Anyone else sneak food into the cinema? Yeah. We always used to take sweets and stuff from... Uh, the Sainsbury's next to Odeon. My mom would put them in a handbag and we'd take them in. Because the prices of sweets, the pick a mix in Odeon is outrageous. It's fucking outrageous. It's it's daylight robbery. Wubba lubba dub dub! Christ, that was very loud. Thank you, Bacon Kevin, for the 50 free months of Prime. Yeah, that's true. Like, if I bought, like, a slushy in the cinema, I'd be done before it actually, the film even began. And I'd be like, damn it, now I just gotta, now all I have to do is pee. <laughs> Oh, great. Now I just now I just really need to pee, and I'm gonna miss a piece of the cinema. A piece of the cinema, piece of the film. I have already opened this door for you. Bam, 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 bam. bam. Amazon flavored kisses from Andy Jassy. Yep. This here's a raw pad. Find another one in this world, and you'll be able to walk between them. Okay. Hey, that's an easy one to get. And it's too... I'm too big. Right, first world. See how much we can actually do. Right, I remember we can't break those until we have the shooting thing. And notes in this are different as well, because they... They come in sets of five, I believe. As opposed to being a hundred individual notes, they made them, uh, they grouped them into sets of five. Yippee! You saved me! I am off for home now! Okay, see ya. No, no, I mean... In the original Bungie, Bungie and Kazooie, each note was a note. In this, each note is five notes at once. In the original, each note is an individual note. They might have been grouped up together, but in this, the, in the note itself, it counts as five notes. one is value is five notes. You found some notes, boy. Now come and find me. <laughs> the mighty shiny one sleeps until his services are required once again. 
this mumbo pad. Mumbo stand on it to perform great magic. You've collected a skill stop, Honeycomb. Press X to stop your energy bar as close to the top as possible. They put so much in this fucking game, it's ridiculous. Chick shock ik zigna quasi. Eh? We speak English in this game. Yeah, we speak English in this game. We don't speak no crazy, crazy language. No gobbledygook in this game. Stop right there. What do you want? We want to go in there. It sounds cool. Of course it's cool. Everyone wants to see the stony kickball games. Stand aside then, Bozo. We'll miss the action. Bozo? I'm an officer Ungo Gopaz, and there ain't no tickets left. They sold out while you were playing Banjo-Kazooie. <laughs> we don't want to watch. We're here to kick butt and win. Nice try. Well, I'm afraid you can't. The games are only open to stonies. Only stone here, stoners. Oh, go on, please. How about a bribe? How dare you. This is a respectable organization. Get lost, both of you. Damn, can't even be bribed. Besides breaking objects in the game, because Wii's Beak Buster also breaks the fourth wheel, fifth wheel, and eighth wheel. No. Donkey Kong 64 Memory League. What was that one? Hey, get your sorry hide over here and press B. Andrew, get a load of this bozo. He looks like bottles in uniform. Of course I look like bottles. You punk, he's my brother. How's the geek keeping anyhow? Not too good. Recently deceased at the hands of Grunty the witch. Sorry to hear that flea ball. Did he go out fighting? Well, playing cards, actually. Typical. So you'll be wanting to learn some of my special moves to get even with the witch, huh? Ah, not really. Bottles taught us loads in the last game. He only knew novice moves. You'll get nowhere without my advanced techniques. Uh, sounds good to us, damn jars. Well, why not teach us a few now? Not that easy, punk. You gotta prove your sorry selves first by collecting me a few notes. Come back if you can find enough. Hey, wait a minute. I see you've got enough. <laughs> anyway, for my first lesson. Uh, listen and learn, you punks. What you need is an aim in sight. Hit the target, then you mine. First person view by pressing Y. Hit L trigger or R to defy with something, something. Find a tough, huh? Looks like you need some rations. That'll be all. Dismissed. Duh, 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 duh. 
I love licking lots of toes. I also have a collection of bows. You found another warp pad. I'll move on to it and press B to warp to any other warp pad that you evacuated in this world. Okay, will do. Those are terrible to get when you have full health. Nice one, punk. Triple clefs are worth a mighty 20 notes. Dang. They really want you to cut down on having to find notes in this game. Here's a move that's a load of fun. Now use Kazooie as a handheld gun. Left trigger or right trigger, fast eggs both high and low. Target dance temple, in you can go. I'll be all. Dismissed! Mm -hmm. You unlocked the gun. Why does it feel like the audio is coming from my left ear? More than... My other ear. The music's coming out more on the left. None of my what cables have gone weird. Yes, they have. It feels like the music on the right isn't coming through properly. Like it's cutting out. I know it's the same for you, I can see it's coming from more on the left. But I don't know why, I don't remember the game being like that. I'm trying to work out if it's, the, if it's the game or if it's my audio setup that's one of the thingy wires has gone funky. I think it's just the world. That feels the same in both ears now. Interesting. The music in this world is left ear focused. Is this a Minjo? Okay. Well, that was a Minjo then. Look at the state of poor bovine's fields. This plague of filthy flies is scoffing my crops. Oh dear, how can we help? Get rid of the pesky flies, of course. Say your prayers, flies. Just shoot these boys down. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.
Amazing. Amazing. A corn hardly believe you wheatly sorted those out. Enough of the crop jokes, lady. I believe you owe us a jiggy. Oh, I guess I do. I corn hardly believe you sorted them out. Ah, oh, man, I can't get up there. I need something else to get up there. Hey, man, this game loves denying you the denying you things. this part. Good, I see you have mastered the art of bird handling. I now challenge you to collect the sacred statues and find your prize. Okay. Look out for door panels in the walls and press A when standing in front of one to open it. Okay. I mean, I see one here. Ding. They couldn't. They just couldn't not have a first person be in this game, could they? Blast these fools away with eggs. Rapid fire eggs. A tournament? How unreal. <laughs> I remember playing quite a lot of the multiplayer in this game with friends. Doing the, like, doing this, playing this first person shoot up thing and stuff like that. I don't remember it being particularly great, but I do remember playing a lot of it with friends. Not bad, mortal. Ten statues gained you entry to my slightly sacred chamber. Let's go to the slightly sacred chamber, shall we? Target ends slightly sacred chamber. Master of Puppets. I always do Master of Puppets by accident when I'm trying to do the Doom one. And then I can't stop doing it then. I'm stuck in Master of Puppets mode now. Nope. I'm stuck. I'm stuck in I'm stuck in Master of Puppets. Master of eggs, I'm pulling your strings. Blinded by me, you won't see a thing. <laughs> I'm blinded by me, you won't see a thing. Just call my. Just shoot my eggs. And I'll scream. Jinjo, 
Jinjo. Those golden eggs. Oh my god, I blew his head off. What the fuck? Oh, rapid fire eggs. I'm gonna 100% this? I, I don't know. You 20 statues gains you entry to my really sacred chamber. Dude, it's like super duper sacred, man. Does that happen a lot, Walking Taco? Look, Banjo, there's another Jiggy. This is just too easy. Yup, we'll have the game finished in no time. This game is a lot less fun to 100% than the first one, so I don't know if we'll 100% it. We'll see. Targetzan, the Spotic Dizzy Totem, I think that's it. I am Targetzan, mighty Mayan god of target shooting. Prepare to meet thy dark ridden doom. Man, these golden eggs make this way easier. <laughs> and they're gone. Suffer as I invoke my sacred self destruct. Well, goodbye, buddy. What kind of what kind of bugs usually come out walking taco? It's also absolutely horrifying that they pull up your shirt. I get out of here now. I'm doing good. Oh, sorry, I didn't even see your uh, message there, Foop LP. I'm doing great. I, uh. I'm doing really well. Thank you for asking. Whoa. there's anything else in this place. I don't super duper remember though. I also don't super duper remember how to get out of here. Uh, I think it's somewhere maybe down here?
Yeah, two is a bit more mature than one. We will do our best. Alright, I can't remember if we can actually get in here yet. Treasure chamber. What's up with you? Oh, it's terrible. I can't find Targetson's favorite priceless relic thingy. I think it may have been stolen. Ah, oh, tough luck. We don't care. Help Chief Blotzizan. Find it and I'll reward you with a jiggy. A jiggy? Oh, well, in that case... Great. I'll open the other door for you, but please hurry. Silver Fisher Badwell, Elite Papers and Books in no time. Uh, centipedes? Oh, God. Okay, okay. I, don't, I remember we can't run up there yet, and I can't super duper remember why, but I know we can't yet. I don't think we can actually do our thing there yet. I know, I know we need to go be Mumbo and take over the statue. Remember that. Oh yes, these little things. You cur you're called a Globo. You're supposed to have magical powers. A Globo. <laughs> ah, bear and bird here at last. Mumbo best shaman in game. So build new skull, Mumbo. Also want to help, but also must find me magic creature. We got a globo. Must give magic creature to Mumbo if want help. Want Mumbo's help? Sure. Are right, you little junkie? Throw it in Mumbo's bag. <laughs> he's, such a little, he's such a little freaky junkie boy. Ah, Mumbo, get to be hero at last. Press X to see mighty shaman zapstick. Return to me to my chair when want to be bear and bird again. Yeah, Mumbo boy. Mumbo time. Do you can switch him in the ground says in the green pool? Ah, I don't know if I did actually, no. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, his, his, his little wand all ran out of juice. I swear, baby, this doesn't usually happen. I can zap all night. Press B to see mighty mumbo magic. All right. Hope, hope this works. Mumbo magic make golden Goliath rise. Magic only lasts short time. To control me again, return statue to its base and press B. Okay, so now as the statue, I remember we have to go and kick some stuff. That, definitely. That too. Kick that baby open.
Yeah. Let's open this baby up too. Oh, okay. <laughs> Just kick a hole in it instead. statue jump. Mumbo magic, run out. I can't remember if we need him for anything else. I guess we'll find out. He can poke him, he can poke him. Wow, wow. Aw, oh, it's a shame you can't transform into him. You can't transform back like that. It's your birthday today? Oh, happy birthday, Blast. Sincerity level maximum. Let's go. Ring. The prison compound. Okay. Well, I can't get over there like that. Remember there being a thing somewhere that lets ah that's what it is. We need the waders so that we can wade. But we need the we need the crawling um we need to be able to have Banjo's ledge hanging power first. Stony can understand what another Stony speaks. Okay. I'm doing anything here right now. Tomorrow? Oh my god, double birthdays. Double birthdays ish, almost. Uh, right, let's go to the world entry exit. Let's get this beautiful fly pad. England one. Damn. 
Oh, no, not an England football win. I'll be dancing for hours. Arr, they'll be dancing for hours. Dun, dun. Hands remotely revolve around eating. Yeah, that sounds good to me. Oh, what's going on down here? something. Unga Bunga's cave. Is that an angry beehive? Oh my god! These are split up pads. That beehive tried to kill me. What was this? It's a giant egg. Hundred and twenty notes. I'm not even close to that one. The Stegosaurus. Not anymore. It's extinct now. Sneak over here very carefully. So I remember this stuff makes a noise when you step on it. If I can reach that from from down here, that's in bolters and cannon. Uh, I don't really know. <laughs> I don't know if there's much of a cannon to Banjo Kazooie. Oh, I can make it. I'm sure it probably is. Just because we don't like it doesn't mean it's not part of the Banjo world. I mean, like, I don't know, they never mentioned the GBA games, I don't think. But the whole, Banjo, Banjo is very meta, so it tends to, like, like reference itself constantly. And... Phone targets and prices relic thingy. 
The caveman stole it. Why, those thieving little... Careful, this is a family game. Oh, yeah, uh, yes, so it is. Why, don't I just give you a jiggy? That makes sense to me. <laughs> ah, uh, purple got me in much trouble. Big beatings. We're fine, but that man's getting a beaten. No, not at all, WW. <laughs> Banjo Nuts and Bolts is made by Rare. Or whatever Rare team exists in Microsoft now. And it's not a racing game. There's, it's not even it's not even in the same genre as uh, Mario Kart. Microsoft owned Rare when Nuts and Bolts came out. and bolts is a 360 thing. This has got to be the grab power. Listen up to what you're told. On the edges you can now hold. Move along, move, right. move along with the greatest of ease. But next to attack, oh please. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. Yeah, there's, ra there's, there's a racing, there's a race part in there, like from some mini games, but it is not a Mario Kart game. Banjo Nuts and Bolts is is an adventure game with vehicles. Where you craft vehicles to do like to solve puzzles, essentially. If I never find my way home, take this jiggy for your trouble. There's only one white Jinjo. Anytime you save a new card, Jinjo. Uh, no. Only when you save the first Jinjo, and then uh, when you save. when you've saved every Jinjo of one color. Catfish, doing all right, doing all right. Cheeky little evening stramoge. Pressing the left stick only slightly will make you tiptoe silently. Yeah, I know that. Warning, trespassers in this quicksand are liable to be eaten. I saw that then, what was that? 
So a little dude popping his head out. Creepy little creature hanging out. I think I need the big guy back in here again. Grumbo? What are they called? I can't remember. Are we playing Pikmin for the 31 year challenge? No. Big heap welcome to little- wait, I missed that bit. I'm Banjo and my favorite friend is Kazooie. Me humble Wumba, best magic person on island. We heard that Mumbo was the best. Not true. Mumbo amateur, Mumbo be um, Wumba best. You bring Globo magic creatures. You have Globo? Want to give, hum want to, give to Humba? I do. Yeah, no, we did, we played Pikmin not that long ago, I think. But, uh, no, I don't plan on playing Pikmin in it. I think Wumbo and... Wumbo and Mumbo are married in Nuts and Bolts. <laughs> the stone man. Ah. This menu to view or change the status of the cheats you have earned. Just link to all the sound systems in the house. If I want, I can. I can imagine Milby is sitting in my bathroom playing games. Oh. Taken, you've taken immersion to the next level. Imagining a streamer is inside your bathroom right now, playing games. That's what we've ever really wanted. <laughs> Under the strong rocks, you will find many surprises. to the beat, it's great. Only the giant gold man can cross this quicksand to get the jiggy. Oh my god. Wait a minute. The stream's coming from inside of the house. He's taking a massive turd in your toilet. This cannot stand. You got the touch. Oh, there's a ginger up there. You never noticed that. So a 
missing four jiggies, one Jinjo, two honeycombs, two two magical pages of Cheeto. Shoot the giant stone ones between the eyes. Okay. Yeah, I think we can join the uh, the, fo the the football now. Oh, um, Banjo the Stony, can I come in and play? Hmm. I don't know. That backpack looks kind of familiar. Are you saying we're a bear and a bird in an elaborate disguise, trying to cheat our way in? Yep. It's pretty obvious. But they're a bit short on players, so you might as well go in anyway. <laughs> Ma'am, when was the last time you were in the, in your bathroom? We have a reason to believe there's a hot tub stream going on in there. <laughs> what in my in my bathroom? Yes, ma'am. There is a there is indeed a hot tub stream going on in your bathroom. Welcome to the Mayan of Amateur Kickball Championship. You may enter the quarterfinals, but I'd advise you take a little training downstairs first. Watch the player coaches for advice. Here's my advice, Sonny. Try to come in first. <laughs> wow, we'd never have thought of that. I reckon you should score lots of points. So, I think we could have worked that one out for ourselves. Use the left stick to move. Left trigger or right trigger to kick the ball and X to barge... Uh, kick the balls into your goal to score two points. Does that help? Well, I'm sure we'll soon find out. Well, you may have just seen England beat Denmark, but get ready to watch Banjo beat Stoney. It did grand, yes. I've watched uh, I've watched uh, two or three of them. The little buff boys competition. And the man that can't the man that is too afraid to ask for other people's food. I can't remember if we put it in our goal. Oh no, okay. Yeah, don't put it in other people's goals. That doesn't help. How dare you? <laughs> oh yeah, we won. We won. First round done. For the cause. You've won your quarterfinal. Move on to the semifinals. Okay. I'm ready. Let's bring on the semis. Professional amateur stony ball player. Rising up the ranks. Those shorts look stupid. Aww. I thought they look pretty cool. May the best stony win. No, damn. Get in there. Oh my god, there was so many balls. Oh my god, purple is unstoppable. Oh my god, only just, only just. It's coming home. It's coming, Stoney's coming home. It's coming home. <laughs> it's coming home. 
It's coming. Stoney's coming home. There's only one Stony banjo. There's only one Stony banjo. Da na na. Da na na. Can someone get some Vuvuzelas? For like really, really feeling it. I think we, I think we need some Vuvuzela sounds. It's coming home. It's coming. <laughs> <laughs> Why was that all coming out of one ear again? Yeah, so let's get some Vuvuzela. There you go, Vuvuzela. the left something has happened to the audio it's all coming out the left ear unless i'm all just getting all unless hang on a minute i need to what the heck am i coming out the left ear am i coming out the left ear? i am coming out the left ear what is going on Get them, let me get those, let me get them Vuvuzelas back, hang on. Well, there we go. It's our beautiful, uh... Vuvuzela! Maybe we can have some football, uh, football, uh, crowd, ch crowd sound effects. finals? I believe I have. I declare you the new main kickball champion. I'm too choked up for words. Beautiful. Came home, boys. We brought football back at last. All this time of asking to bring it home, and we did. Stony's a great big phony. To free the trapped one, the moon must appear before the first star. The sun rises next, after which comes two more stars. Well, I think so. The moon must appear first. So moon. First star. So moon, star, sun, two stars. Mm. 
Sheen Reeves. I, I, I can't even say that name right. <laughs> Sheen. 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 Scene Bean, Sean. <laughs> scene. I always say Sean like scene for some reason. Scene Bean. Shit. He goes moon, star, sun, star, star. Hello, my little rabbit friend. Me, me, Dilberta, was out looking for gold when that boulder fell down and trapped me in here. I suppose you expect us to move it? Me, if you wouldn't mind. Well, that's another thing I can't do right now. If I remember rightly, we have to do that. <laughs> I think if we break that boulder, it actually links to like World Two or something like that. There's a lot. Of, there's a lot of interworld linking in this game. Which I will admit was a cool feature. Damn, those wellies are huge. Those wellies are thick as hell. They're way bigger than they were before. Take that, you son of a bitch. No. Right, so now we need to be... Go to the world entry and exit. Ready to collect monsters tomorrow? Is that when Monster the Thingy comes out? Tomorrow? Oh, that's what I forgot to do, was to get the honeycomb. Shit. that gets unlocked later on. Like, maybe it's not there in the first like, world, I don't know. Wouldn't put it past this game to have it locked behind some random thing. But uh, yeah, I haven't, I haven't ordered Monster Hunter World, uh, Monster, Monster Hunter Stories 2. Um, I don't know. I never played the demo, actually. I should have played the demo to see if I liked it. Ekon Bokom, Ekon Bokom, wow, wow. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> I love how he's like, oh my god, get me the fuck out of here. I don't know who this Corona is. They've stolen, they've stolen the identity of Banjo and I'll never forgive them. while I'm streaming and then I will forget to watch them afterwards so they'll probably just never get watched. Did you say soccer or football? Football? Ah, damn. <laughs> Do you mind if the song was Soccer's Coming Home? Good God. Soccer's coming home. And just cries. It's coming home. It's coming. Soccer's coming home. Soccer's. <laughs> Soccer's. You actually get mocked relentlessly in the UK if you ever refer to football or soccer. I'm not joking. If you say soccer in the UK, you are gonna you better be ready for a whole heap of shit coming your way. Yeah, they just deport you straight away. It's really harsh. Very, very harsh. Football's coming on. It's coming on. It's coming. <laughs> Sorry if I talked American. I refuse straight out to say it regardless. I'm just that, I'm just, I'm that person, I guess. They'll say, oh, do you mean soccer? And I'll go, soccer? And I like, got a stupid American accent, and then they'll go, I'll be like, yeah, yeah. Every time. Hey, one pint of lager and crisps, please, and put on the soccer game, will ya? Cut to you being thrown out of a pub. Ah! What did I do? Probably Sammy, but I always do it in the voice, in the accent. Soccer goal. I gotta get me a soccer goal. I always sit like that. <laughs> Soccer goal! My total rad Chad card is showing. Oh no. 
Um, can I go into the stadium lobby as manager? No, I think. I don't think there's much. Oh no, I can go to the treasure room. I might be able to get something in there. total so far. We're missing a single jiggy and one honeycomb and two pages. Why the hell would we be missing a jiggy from here? Stonies only are allowed to enter the game. Even I have to be from that side. Okay. You got football, you got rugby, and you got that. American football, where they wear the pads and all that. <laughs> tell me, tell you, you get them playing a game of rugby, they wouldn't be able to last two seconds. <laughs> That's the usual thing you'll hear. Not, not, like, the, not, not, not realizing that, in fact, American football. When I realized you could tackle off the ball in American football, I was like, oh. That's why they wear protective gear. <laughs> and they go so hard. Although maybe they wouldn't go as hard if they didn't wear all the protective stuff. Snacks. Good job. <laughs> helmet. There's no helmets. Unless you want to wear one of those little, like, uh, little soft, soft little hat, hat, hat things. But I suppose we take the head, but I don't know if it actually does. Most people, most most of them are wearing nothing, nothing at all, just pure naked, naked rugby, balls out, flopping in the breeze. Oh, I see Amsterdam. I didn't even see. I didn't even see walking tackle thing. I thought you just said I remember everything from bug snacks for like no fucking reason at all. I was so confused. Just like you were just like sitting in a room with people just going, you know, I remember everything from bug snacks. Okay. Anyway, um, so how the, how's the, how, how's our portfolio looking? It's actually looking pretty. Yeah, you know, just anything from bug snacks. I can remember anything. Ask me a question, you know, I'll, I'll, I can do it. So, yeah, um, where was I? Uh, oh, yeah, the stock portfolios. Um, yeah, you know, like, uh, you want to know what the professor names was, or, like, what, maybe, like, what the, the type of bugs they were? I could tell you them. You could, I could, I could tell you them. You know? If you want to, if you want to ask me, I, I could tell you. Okay. Yeah. Cool. I wish it'd been like that. That just sounds like I'm doing it. I think you should leave bed after. <laughs> I 
mean, I could do that. I could answer, you know, you give me a question, I'll, I'll answer no problem. Okay, I think we will, uh, I think we'll leave this world for now. We're missing a jigsaw, and we're missing a... Uh, we're missing two cheat sheet things. Um, but we'll return. I'm not sure if we can actually get the last one until way later on. 